Good morning, Nerdigans. This is the one and only Packer Girl 89 of Nerdigans Inc. And today's manga Nerdigan live reaction video is going to be for Miramashita Umumakan chapter 278. So before I get into this recap and live reaction, let me just remind you to hit that like, share, and subscribe buttons. And because, of course, this channel, let alone this video, are not sponsored. If you love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking so we can keep bringing you more anime and manga content, whether it be news, analysis, or live reactions like this one, feel free to hit up our cash app and PayPal links are in the description box below. So, and yeah, last chapter, opera, uh, got mixed reviews. Some were excited and some were extremely scared. Very, very scared, including the teachers. And um, the misfits, yeah, they're training. Yeah, Katie, you're right. Their training is something that, um, like, we've seen out of Black Clover with uh, Marleona. That's the best way to describe it. Mm hmm. But, anyways, let's get to this chapter, see what's in store for us this week. And this chapter is titled The Number of the Beast. Opera Sensei's special lesson. No flying, no bloodline magic, no familiars. Use no more than simple magic and your own strength to get to the top. Uh-oh. Yeah. Pause. <sighs> Let's review our situation. We're at the foot of a spire. We managed to make uh, some headway, but the upper part of the rock is so smooth that it's unclimbable. They said we could use simple magic. So wouldn't simple magic like include making footholds and shit to climb it? And as for magic, we can use uh, Chirishiru, La Fire, Fractal, uh, so light, and uh, La Vera. <laughs> How about creating a ladder with your issue, see? That's what I was thinking. Transform. I see. Genius. That spire's very tall. It took a lot of time, and we might run out of mana on the way. A way to climb that's easy on both our mana and stamina. Hmm. Oh, damn. They, I didn't think about that. Well, using only simple magic. This is way too hard. Oh, what? This is way too hard. Oh, I could do it in, um... Oh. Garrus is right. I could do it in one shot with my bloodline magic. More so, it'd be faster if we could fly. Did Aquasan add those conditions to put me and the demons on equal footing? Yes. I'll do my best. Hey, I have an idea. There's certainly a way to preserve mana while reaching the top. Oh, that's Alistair for you. I call, <laughs> I call it Operation Suicide Cannon. Operation Suicide Cannon? That's one hell of a name. Uh, well, it's fairly simple in theory, but it requires one of us to take a bit of a risk. Preferably that one demon should be a, of a high rank and good with Chirishu. Uh, wait, wait, Chirishiru, and have a small rounded build. Kitty, are you good with Chirishiru? Because you are small, we can make you round. And you would be useful for this. He's like, no, don't look at me. <laughs> high rank, small rounded, 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 high rank, small rounded. Uh, uh, uh. Are you prepared, Aroma? Yes. Kitty, are you a high ranking demon, kitties? Are you a high ranking demon, kitties? So, are you a high ranking demon, kitties? He's like, no. Are you prepared, Aroma? Yeah, uh, yes. If something goes wrong, just fly. Um, okay. Uh, be careful. Yes. Farewell, Parson. <laughs> okay. Sad not you bastard animal with more care. Just get on with the spell. Hey, don't pass him like that. Right, kitties? Oh, key, ready. Oh, here's the key. He's ready. He ready. One, make the cannonball, um, Aruma lighter. Fractal. Uh, here goes. Okay. Let's see. Give him a boost. Libera! Whoa! Imagine a platform. 
um, two right before Libera and Fractal wear off immediately. Imagine a platform. Cheershiru! Could you do this, kitty? Could you do this? Could you hit Cheershiru? <gasps> My kitty said he could do it. He is a powerful kitty. I didn't realize you were a powerful demon kitty. Why can't you do magic and stuff? You're hiding out on me. Bastard kitty. This one's hiding out. He is holding out. He is holding out on me, this kitty. You hiding your powers, aren't you, kitty? You're doing this on purpose. What? He's like, yes, I'm, I'm practicing magic in my sleep. That's why I sleep all day. Because I'm going to use it when I need to. Fuck everybody up. The keys. Yeah, that's my key. See, I figured out my cat's scheme. My key is scheming. He is scheming. He's coming for all of us. Right, Key? He's coming for everyone. Yeah, see? He knows. He's a smart key. He's a smart demon key. My key probably training at Babylon while he's sleeping. Silly demon keys. Oh, gracious. Uh, all of a sudden, every single time you almost, every single time you almost gave me a heart attack. Sheesh. Don't try to fly when you can't fly. Oh, sorry and thank you. But I thought it'd be okay because you were here, Alison. I'm not all powerful, you know. Come on. But well, I'll be careful with my mana. He's getting better and better with magic. Where has the time gone? You be you're becoming quite the demon, aren't you? Yes, you are. You're becoming quite the demon, aren't you, cat? He is, isn't he? He's becoming quite the demon, cat. Right, keys. Um, Aromasama, are you all right? I'm good. Rope, uh, go on some. I'll be infused with quartz, uh, wait, quartz, quartz. Ooh. Okay, everyone. Fractal, let's go. Here we go. Uh, step three, pull everyone up, um, after they become lighter. <sighs> That's one leaf down, and we've already gotten so far. Well, they have. So, uh, we just do this, um, to the top, right? Have fun. Yes, let's change roles, too, to save mana. Um, I want to fly next. Oh, Clara wants to fly next. Yes. As this will be the cannon. Um, don't climb on me before using... <laughs> As this will be the cannon. <laughs> Don't climb on me before using fractal. I see. That's a rather interesting way to climb. Amazing. They're amazing. Even with their limited abilities, uh, they show good judgment and creativity. Moreover, they trust each other and they reach the top with everyone uh, their common goal. This not demonic mindset of theirs is both their strength and an opportunity for them to grow. I see. Um, but they're almost at that point, aren't they? Okay, another success. I could see the summit already. We're so high up. The wall is kind of a um, black beyond this point. M why? No worries. It just means we're closer to the top. Let's just keep trucking and we'll be there in no time. Yeah. Oh, no. Lead. Uh-oh. Here I go. One, two, Libera. Huh? I didn't go very far. Whoa, yeah. Mika, are you okay? What happened? I don't know. I slipped down all of a sudden. My body feels heavy. I threw as hard as I could. Huh? Then why? Transform. Hmm. A ladder vanish? A six second wall. A merciless wall. Your ideas, teamwork, and trust, all of them will be reduced to nothing. This is the wall of despair that repels all magic. Ooh, now this is the real test. So, the first part of the test, well, would you guys say this is like the first part or the second part? I'd say this is the second part because the first part was getting up to the first portion of the, of the mountain. This was the second part of the test. Now, the third part of the test is the wall of despair, getting over the wall of despair that repels all magic. So, they gotta be smart about this. You can't use any magic now. And how much higher do they have to go? Hmm. So now they gotta rely on their physical abilities. How will 
they do this is the real question. It looks like there's some curve on the side, but is it is this part of the mountain completely smooth? If it is, this is going to be very, very hard to do. If it is, oh God, it's going to be a pain in the ass. This could be every now. This is every demon for themselves, but unless nah, I don't know if um your ideas of teamwork. Offer saying your ideas of uh, teamwork and trust all of them will be reduced to nothing. I don't know about that. I don't know, but this is very very important. I understand why this is important too. Because the opponents that they will be facing, this is why opera doing this is really important. This training is very important for them. It's because remember who they are going to be facing. They will be facing the fingers at some point. And when they face the fingers, they will probably have the ability to take away their magic. They're going to face this and they will have to deal with it somehow. This is going to be very interesting to see how they confront this. I'm really curious what you guys think. I don't think they'll be able to build like a tower or whatnot. I think they could, mm, is Tadmok strong enough to like throw Aruma and, um, and lead and Clara without any magic? Maybe. I think Samak would be the only one that could do it out of all of them. Just not using any magic. And I'm very curious what you guys think. How do you guys think that they're going to overcome this? Do you guys think it's going to be teamwork and uh, ideas of teamwork and trust? Are they going to be reduced to nothing, or do you think they're going to come up with something? Let me know your thoughts in the comment section below, and remember to like, comment, share, and subscribe to Nerdigan's Hink. I love what we're doing and want to help keep this operation alive and kicking, so I can keep bringing you more Rumakun content. A few ways you could do that. Donate to our cash app, PayPal, Patreon, purchase something off our Amazon wishlist, all that's in the description box below. Also, make sure you follow us on Twitter, Twitch, Discord, friend us on PlayStation Network. That is in the description box below as well. Till next time, Nerdigans, I'll be seeing you later. Bye!